Nanotechnology. Perhaps you've heard the term, but what in the world is nanotechnology? Nanotechnology is the manipulation of matter at the molecular or nano scale. Just to give you an idea, an ant is 5 million nanometers long. A red blood cell is 7,500 nanometers long. And DNA is 2.5 nanometers long. That's small. Very, very, very small. I'm Jim Mason, the Nano Man, and I'm going to tell you four things about nanotechnology. What it is, how it's being used in products, how Oklahoma companies are using it, and how you can learn more about nanotechnology. Nanotechnology is an enabling technology, which means it enables us to make new structures, devices, and systems. It's much like, what? Electricity. Imagine a world without electricity, without computers, televisions, or light bulbs. Aren't we glad we have light bulbs? Back to nanotechnology. Think of the molecules that make up this desk. What if we could manipulate those molecules to make it fireproof? Let's move this one here, and this one there, and this one up here. Yeah, that'll do it. This manipulation is an example of nanotechnology, and the resulting product would be better than the original. Nanotechnology is what makes this shirt waterproof. Take a closer look. Nanotechnology makes this tennis racket 22% more powerful and lighter than a normal one. Whoa. Nanotechnology makes this hockey stick 70% more impact resistant. Did you know that nanotechnology is being used in Oklahoma products? In Broken Arrow, ARC Outdoors makes honey gear. This honey gear uses nanotechnology to eliminate body odor. Imagine wearing socks for three days and they still don't stink. That's amazing! Imation in Weatherford, Oklahoma uses nanotechnology to greatly increase the storage capacity of computer backup tapes. This tape looks like any other tape, but by manipulating the molecules on the tape, it has four times the memory. What a deal! I'm here with Jay Martin, founder of Martin Bionics. Hi, Jay. Hi, Jim. Tell us a little bit about your technology, Jay. Well, Martin Bionics develops new technologies for prosthetics, for amputees. Currently, we're using nanotechnology in this covering, which attaches the body in the prosthetic. Nanotechnology is used to make this covering more hygienic and more comfortable. Nanotechnology will allow our designs to be super light and super strong at the same time. This is essential for creating devices that are durable for everyday activity and suitable for everyday wear. That's great! Thanks, Jay! No problem, Jim. By manipulating the molecules in these products, they take on more desirable properties, making them faster, stronger, smaller, lighter, and more durable. Would you like to be one of these engineers? We actually have training programs in place at universities throughout Oklahoma. Nanotechnology will change everything man-made this century. It's already being used in products today, and it will be used more and more in products in the future. I'm Jim Mason, the Nano Man. It's been a pleasure today telling you about nanotechnology. To find out more information, go to our website, www.oknano.com.